Hi guys, welcome back. Subscribe to my channel and also click on the bell icon to turn on the notifications so that you won't miss any of my videos in the future. Today, I'm going to share with you all how you can get baby soft, smooth and shiny legs easily at home. This is a very simple remedy and you can do it naturally at home. Step 1 is to remove any unwanted hair from your legs. I like waxing instead of shaving. Shaving can bring back really thick hair but if you wax regularly then there will be a very significant reduction in hair growth. I like the ready-made store-bought wax strips which is really easy to use. I have been using this method since I was in high school and it has really reduced my hair growth to a great extent. Waxing also helps to remove the dead skin cells, revealing the fresh layer of your skin. After waxing, use the after wax strips that are provided with the pack to remove any wax residues from your legs. Now on to step 2 which is cleansing. Here I am using a baby wash to cleanse my legs. You can use anything that you like, it really doesn't matter. But what matters is how you clean your legs. Massage your legs and feet with the cleanser for 2-3 to three minutes to thoroughly cleanse your legs. Now wash it off with lukewarm water and pat dry. Next step is to make a detoxifying foot and leg soak. For this you will only need two simple ingredients that is some apple cider vinegar and two tablespoons of salt. Now take a basin and fill half of it with warm water and add two tablespoons each of apple cider vinegar and salt. Now soak your feet for 5 to 10 minutes. As you can't soak the whole leg, what you can do is simply splash your leg with the detoxifying water for some time. Apple cider vinegar can protect against bacteria, fungi and other harmful microbes. So putting it into a food soak could have potential benefits for the feet and legs. ACV and salt can treat nail fungus and also any leg pain. This will help you relax your tired feet. Now don't throw this water, we will use it for the next step as well. So now let's move on to the next step which is to use a pumice stone or if in case you don't have a pumice stone like me then you can use your own DIY food scrub which is just a lemon and some salt. Take a piece of lemon and dip it into the salt like this and scrub it onto your feet. It acts as a pumice stone and will remove all the dead skin cells of your feet. But if you have a pumice stone then skip this step and use your own pumice stone to scrub your feet. You can use the salt and lemon all over your legs if you want but it's optional. This will give some added shine to your legs. But don't overdo it as it's a bit aggressive. After scrubbing, just wash it off with the same food soak water. Now also, don't forget to trim your nails. After washing your legs, pat dry and throw the water away. Now on to step 5 which is exfoliating. For this you will need extra virgin olive oil, 100% pure honey, sugar and some instant coffee powder. Now, take a bowl and add 1 tablespoon of sugar, 1 teaspoon of instant coffee powder, 3 teaspoons of honey, 
mix everything now add two teaspoons of extra virgin olive oil and mix very well your scrub will be in a very thick consistency now add some water into the basin and scrub your legs and your feet with the DIY scrub for like five minutes be very gentle and please don't be aggressive this combination of scrub brings an enjoyable ease to the process of buffing away dead skin cells from your feet and legs Coffee is known to stimulate blood flow to the skin, improving the appearance of stretch marks, celluloid and other skin conditions. Caffeine also contains a ton of antioxidants which are great for our skin including fighting the battle against premature aging of the skin. Honey is a humectant which means that it traps and seals moisture making it ideal to apply to dry, cracked heels. It also helps to reveal the dryness and heal the cracks from your feet. It helps ward off bacteria, which is an added benefit if you have any open cracks that run deeper. After scrubbing for like 5 minutes, wash it off with some warm water. Here, you can already see that my legs are shining. Now, let's not stop here. Let's take it to another level. Moving on to the next step, smoothening and brightening mask. For this, you will need basin, turmeric powder and some orange blossom water. You can also use rose water instead. It will give the same benefits. Now, take a bowl and add 3 teaspoons of chickpea flour or basin. 1 teaspoon of turmeric powder and slowly add in the orange blossom water and mix it into a smooth consistency like this. Now apply it all over your legs as shown in the video. This mask contains both basin and turmeric powder which are really good for your legs and feet. It will smoothen your skin and will treat any infections, cuts or any food related problems. It also has brightening properties and will also remove scars and marks from your legs, making it smoother and shinier. Let it sit for 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, wash it off with lukewarm water and pat dry. You're going to love the results. Your legs and feet will feel smoother and shinier. I hope you can see the difference. Now on to our final and important step which is moisturizing. I'm going to simply use extra virgin olive oil to moisturize my legs. You can also use coconut oil, ojoba oil or any moisturizer that you like. But my favorite, my personal favorite is olive oil. Applying olive oil to the skin can prevent signs of photo aging and sun damage. So try this at home you guys. You are going to love the results. Your legs will become baby soft and smooth. So that's it for this video guys. If you enjoyed this video then please give a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel and also click on the bell icon to turn on the notifications so that you will get notified every time I upload a new video. Share this with your friends and family and you can also follow me on my Instagram and other social media. The links will be in the description box below. Thank you guys. Bye. Love you.